right? So this is great. Got dropped off. I know what it is. Um, try to make this quick video. It might need a little bit of modification, but spoiler, spoiler. I'm not giving away any spoilers. Spoiler. <laughs> You guys know that Monty doesn't have a spoiler on it yet. And it's just one of those things that I did that popped in my head. I want to see if it'll work or not. So, there's not too many modern cars that are pretty much flat without a curve to it, like the Camaros. But there's one car that's pretty flat and resembles the uh, older style, uh, pretty close. Let me go grab the tripod. So, I'm just saying, just sitting behind one one day and I was like, man, that's, wonder if it'll work. Cause I couldn't see it just fine right now, spending $250, $300 just for the spoiler. So I was like, if I get my hands on one of these for pretty cheap, I'm gonna see if it works. So I'm gonna open it up and then tell you guys where it came from. And see if it works or not. What do you guys think it is? What car? I try to look it up, see if anybody else has done it. Because measurements online, they're pretty close. I think, uh, I think the model is half an inch wider than what the spoiler measures, not what the car measures. But I told myself if I get one for cheap, I'll try it out. It fits. So. Might need some minor modifications just because the body line down the center of the deck lid on here. But curve to it. So I don't know. I don't know. Ah. I have to order the different style is just straight. Because sticks out just right. These little two sections. If it was straight, I think it'd be perfect. I don't know. <laughs> it's. I think it's fitting. Like I said, just that little piece right there and right there. So that's pretty much flush. A little bit of hang over there and then it just sticks out here. But I'm gonna turn it off. I'm gonna throw one of the tail light bezels in and see how it looks then. All right, so just threw the tail light uh, bezels in. 
I don't know. I think. Uh, I'd have to see what the um, ones that aren't curved look like. I like said just these little areas right here, but. I might have to grab some tape and then I'll tape it into place real fast so it's not moving and then I might have to switch to the phone pretty soon. Alright, I'm going to keep using the camera until it dies. It's probably got another two minutes in it, so I don't know. I think I might use it. I'm going to put up a video and probably up on Facebook, see what people think. But I think if it's a straight one, I like it a little bit better just because these two corners just right here just sticks out just slightly. But at the same time, it works. It works on the car. So, I'll get some still shots and everything, but like I said, when I looked up online, I had the measurements on there. And I think it was half an inch, which, yeah, it could come over just a little bit. Like I said, this one has a little bit of room on the bottom, or on this side, it's hanging over just a little bit. But I believe it's shifted over, everything's lined up, sitting flush all the way around. Whew. Like I said, I wanted the wicker bill style, just so it has a little indention in there. I might throw the wicker bill on it eventually, but I think if I did do just the straight one without the wicker bill, it's a little shorter. <sighs> I think it fit a little bit better, better. But as far as it goes, I don't know. I'm gonna see what other people think. See if it's a go or no go. But I think. A Challenger spoiler on Amani, I think it's possible. It saves you about 200 something dollars. But, just something modern that just popped in my head. I haven't seen anybody else do it yet. If someone has, let me know. But I think it is possible to put a Challenger spoiler on Amani. The whips are about the same. Like I said, probably half an inch to play with, if that. Not even that, but like I said, it's just, if I'd got one that was straight instead of this little curve on it, I think these are the SRT styles, but if I don't want the stock style, I believe that is just straight and it would have fit perfect, but I'm going to see, I'm going to check with some people before I drill into the trunk or the deck lid, um, but I think, I think it's a go. I think I'd get away with it. What do you guys think? Guess the Dodge ones do it too. There's a little bit of a gap back there. It's more the straight one. I think this has a little less of a curve, but there's still a curve in there. Look at that. A little Z06. I don't know, it's a manual. Yeah, I just stopped the love seat. How about that? Alright guys. What do you guys think? Is it a go or no go? Um, I personally think it's a go. I've sent the idea to a, a couple people. Kind of kept it on the low. So I sent it to a couple people. They've all said they like it. It's a lot beefier than the stock one. I'm not going to say it's a replacement. But you guys think the Challenger spoiler on the Monty, I'm not sure about other G-bodies, but on the Monty, do you think it's a good option? Like I said, I, I think it's a go. I like it. I checked out a few other uh, Challengers with similar spoilers, and they have a slight gap here. Of course, it's a little bit larger once you get to the satellite area but I think it works with the car um, 
I said, if, if it was up to me, yeah, I would like it just flush, like on the stock ones, but I think it looks good. <laughs> I think it looks good. Like I said, I've had some good feedback. Um, just let me know what you guys think. Of course, it'll either be color match or black. I'm still, I'm kind of leaning more towards color match. Let me know what you guys think. Is it a good option for it? And should I do color match or should I do black? Just, just let me know. It'll still it'll be a while before I actually mount it. Um because just having a drill into the trunk lid and everything. I'm gonna make sure measure about three or four times and then cut once. No, it's usually not the dash the garage way. I used to measure once and cut about five, six times, but um, I'm gonna try to do it right. Try to measure a bunch of times and cut once, but yeah, so I'll put this down. Well, flip the camera around and give you guys a couple more shots, but like I said, it's probably quarter inch quarter inch difference but I don't know I like it y'all see that y'all see that <laughs> of course the trunk's not done all the way but oh yeah I think that's gonna work but uh yeah like I said let me know you guys think it's a good option should I go black should I color match it And let me know if it's been done before, because I haven't seen it done. I've asked around to a couple people. They haven't seen it. Let me know if somebody else has done it first. I don't I don't know.